let's look at how to use list comprehensions in a more advanced way. We've, we've seen that if we just uh, wanted to double each element of a list, then we could do it in two lines instead of one. You may not think that that's very beneficial. So let's do something slightly more advanced. We'll create a new list of values. And now I want to say, let's do a doubling of each value in vals only if it's divisible by five. Okay, so if we didn't use list comprehensions, we'd uh, create a new list, an empty one. We'd iterate over each element in vals. We would check uh, if it's divisible by five, which we could do by v mod five equals equals zero. If this is true, then we will append two times v to that list. And we see that we get 10, 20, and 30, which corresponds to 5 times 2, 10 times 2, and 15 times 2. So now we had to use a for statement and an if statement and an append uh, and create an empty list. So how can we do this in one step? Well, we'll use list comprehensions. So we'll say vals to uh, underscore 5, which will indicate 2 times the values that are divisible by 5. We'll say 2 times v for v and vals, and then we add an if statement to the end of this clause. If v mod 5 equals equals 0. So the syntax here is the same as before, except we add an if statement at the end, if v mod 5 equals equals 0. And this if statement will say only operate here if this holds for v. And we look at vals 2, 5, and it's 10, 20, 30, as expected.